let's unpack my new jewel together. So I have officially graduated from first term to second term. Well, almost. Metaphorically, you don't graduate, but. And my foreman has decided that I am gonna drill and pull houses by myself. Well, not by myself, but. So they gave me this drill. It's a mixing drill. It's not even, it's not a Milwaukee drill. And if you don't know what that means, it's just, it's not gonna be used for what it's meant for. And it's gonna take me a very long time to drill out a house. But that's okay, at least they gave me one. A lot of stuff in there. drill. Makita is actually a really good brand. It's just, and it's powerful. It's just going to take me a long time because it doesn't have speed settings. But it'll get the job done. Then comes with this thingy, which I think I go here. I know on the Milwaukee one, it's like this, but that's obviously not. Or it's over here, whatever. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's 7:20 a.m. Got up 5:30. It's a Monday. I started off at a new job site today, so this will be fun. I hope. I hope it'll be fun. It's minus 11 outside and snowing, so. Hopefully it warms up a little bit because that's freaking cold and we don't have heaters here, I don't think. Sometimes they have those little propane heaters or natural gas heaters, but usually you have to ask for them and I don't know if the guys have asked for them yet. It's getting to that point of the year where it's not super dark anymore at 7.30. It starts lightening up around 6.40 now, I think, which is nice because those dark early mornings are rough sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, I need to pull over and sleep. But obviously you can't do that. So you're just, you're dozing at the steering wheel, which is super safe. Not really, it's not safe at all. So I go to bed at 8.30 p.m. every night. I figured though, until the guys get here, I'll uh, show you guys where we work every day. I'm doing roughings right now, so it's pretty much outside all day, every day. It's great, it's a good time. Can't forget the bucket. Don't ever forget your hard hat. You'll get screamed at. Ugh, my trunk's a mess. I'm just gonna take the tool belt now. Put my headlamp on because it's so dark. Pretty much it. Someone forgot their hammer.
how you know it's cold outside. The clear insulation starts cracking off. It actually snowed so much. It snowed so much. <laughs> There's like 10 or 20 centimeters outside. But there you have it. I figured I'd show you guys a day in the life of the rough and lifestyle. I enjoy it. It's a lot of work, but I love it. It's not a glamorous job, but I mean, it pays the bills and I love it. So better than being stuck in a cubicle all day. The thought of actually being in an office right now, like I would pick being out in the snow in minus 20 any day all day if it meant I didn't need to be or didn't have to be in a cubicle or any office for that matter. Anyways, I hope you guys had a good day. I had a great day. I'm gonna go home, have a nice hot shower, see my puppers, and yeah, we'll talk soon. <laughs>